Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and up to now, I haven't paid any attention to the SpaceX uh, explosion of that rocket, but when I uh, saw a news article on it, I was intrigued. So, I'm using a program called Filmora, and Filmora... Basically, it's it uses great videos. Let's put it that way. Well, that's what I normally use. So we're gonna take a look. I want you to pay attention. We're gonna go through this frame by frame. I got some things to show you that is really going to knock your socks off. Notice the time. Twenty-four seconds. Point seventeen, twenty four point seventeen seconds into the video. I got this video from Paranormal Crucible. Thank you very much. Hope you don't mind my using it. Okay, so we're going to advance one frame. It's now time is now twenty four point one eight. If you notice, the UFO has entered the frame right there. Other people have blown this off and it looks like a flying saucer. Okay, we're going to advance one more frame. 24.19. UFO is right there. It's passing the right hand most rocket gantry. If that's what those are, I'm assuming. Going to go forward one more frame. 2420. Notice that the UFO has advanced in a hundredth of a second that far. That thing was really hauling. Now, here's the next frame 421. So in a hundredth of a second, here we have the initial explosion. Notice where the UFO is. UFO is right here. So it's flying over the rocket gantry. Also take a look right here. There's something curious that I spotted. Okay. Next frame. It may just be part of the rocket. UFO is now directly over the rocket, or very near it. It's impossible to tell. There's one object over here, and we're seeing the explosion again happening. Note the position of the UFO. It's now past the rocket. And that amount of time, the UFO is booked on pass here. The explosion hasn't even uh, grown much. That shows you how fast the UFO is going. It's going at unbelievable speed. No, it's not a plane. It's not a drone. It's just too fast. Next frame. UFO is out of the frame altogether. Not much to see here. The explosion still hasn't grown very big. I'm going to start advancing. There's something I want, need, you need to see. You need to take this video and uh, show it. And you need to do a little research. We're going to advance one frame at a time. Note down here there's something. Pay attention. And again, right here. Okay, we're going. And again, 
we have another archer heading up from the left. I'm sorry, these aren't drones. They're cer certainly not birds. So here we have another UFO is heading up. And also keep watch up in this area. So it's probably the same UFO and probably double back to take a look at this handiwork. Here it is again right here. Now look, we have an object heading up. We have a UFO here and another one possibly here. So it looks like there are a bunch of UFOs. It's hard to tell what's debris. But this one down here wasn't debris because it was heading up from the left. Now here we have the UFO we passed in the back of the rocket, and it's headed out to the right. And again, we have this persistent object here. It's better. You see the object there? It's right there. It's staying stationary, which it can't do under the laws of physics. So it's powered craft of some kind. And there's another one. Take a look, there's another one right there. That's not part of the explosion, I don't believe. This object stays up here, so it's not part of the explosion debris. It can't be. It would be a violation of the laws of physics. It has to be falling if it's part of the explosion debris. I know you're going to say updrafts, updrafts, hogwash. If it's a solid piece of object, it's got to come down. So whatever it is, is hovering over the explosion area. Apparently observing. Now it's all fiery, it's moving slowly to the left. I think the explosion is just uh, reflecting off it. All right, going to go for it. Freeze that. Okay, folks. The explosion has already happened. So how is it these objects are gaining an altitude? They can't under the laws of physics. You know, Run backwards a little. Keep a keen eye on these three objects right here. One goes across. One goes up. This one here that's going by the rocket gantry is holding a lateral line, which you can't do under the laws of physics. Not if it's an unpowered part of the explosion. It's grossly. I'm 
whatever it is headed on out. It didn't fall as near as I can tell. This is grossly obvious evidence. These are UFOs. This is big time, big time trouble. At least as far as I'm concerned it is. Uh, there's multiple UFOs in this video, folks. Multiple. And there's no way in hell you're going to tell me this is coincidence. There's no such thing. No such thing as a coincidence. If one object went straight across, it can't do that. Other object hovered above the thing. It can't do that. be on power. I believe this one is just a piece of debris. This is... Holy mackerel. I didn't pay any attention. I heard ideas of maybe UFOs. I didn't pay any attention, but... Uh, yeah, we got a major problem here. I'm going to tell you what I think happened. I think somebody's putting us on notice. We're on the verge of World War III, and I think somebody just told us, cool it or else. That's my opinion. Well, do I have to replay this? Paranormal Crucibles video. That's what it looks like in normal time. Notice how normal debris falls. That one bright object is kind of questionable, but there's one, another one that's hanging right there. that. Here's uh, Paranormal and Crucible's enhancement. Now you know the credit for this. I'm just showing you what's here. See it until you slow it down. That one bright one, I don't know. Okay, folks, this is very disturbing. You can judge for yourself, but I think we got something going on here that's. I think we've been told colder routes. That's my opinion. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Gotta go. Thanks so much for watching. And give the credit to Paranormal Crucible for the video. Thank you very much. I'm Artifacts of Mars.